Hey everybody, Omega Olden here, back again with more Hollow Knight. Uh, we just recently upgraded our... Uh, weapon? And... I don't know, we got some exploring to do. This guy's making some good noises. I don't have a map of this area, so I assume that our friend is somewhere in the area. Maybe he's not. Oh, two hits on those guys now! We're out of control. That is an awesome upgrade. I mean, that in combination with our, uh... What you call it? Our relic or whatever we have equipped. Oh! We gotta be careful of those guys. Do we have a... We still don't have a map. I'm not sure where I want to go right now. We gotta wander around the city. Find things to do. Let's use the dash where appropriate. So I can't go this way. This is blocked off. That's fine. What about over here? No thank you, sir. I will have none of that. I don't want what you're offering. You guys are... T uh, this is where I came in, right? Yeah, okay. Was there anything up here to get? Did I go this way? Oh, I went this way and there was, like, gems. I remember. So we're locked in here. We're trapped in here. Which is fine. But we need to be heading in a better direction. A direction that will let us leave. Which direction is that? Not, uh, not sure. I'd like to get a little more money, because I'm sure when I run into map, map friend, uh, he'll want, like, probably, like, 200 or something. Seems reasonable from map friend. Okay, so, here's our buddy. I wonder, does he say anything new now that we've been wandering around about? Hmm. Yeah, he's not. He just likes the ring. Rain is good. I like the rain. I enjoy sitting out on the patio for the rain. As long as it's like comfortable temperature. Like, it's pretty relaxing and all that. I enjoy it. Okay, so we need money. to make sure to fight these gentlemen whenever we get a chance. Oops, he was still alive. I thought I hit both of them. Uh, let's heal up. We remember that landing on that thing is like a... Landing on spikes. Oh yeah, could, should we go up again and do the jump off? I don't remember if there was, uh, like, st stuff we didn't see over here. I think there might have been because it was, you know, a dangerous area and I kind of backed off. Sad that he dropped his stuff. Ouch, ouch. That, uh, upgrade that auto-collects things, like, the magnet upgrade would be nice, but, you know, I have a limited amount of space to equip things. I don't remember what my- oh yeah, my one point thing is the me on the, the map, so... I'm not exactly the best at navigating my way around here, so I'd prefer to keep that one for sure. I don't know- do I get more slots? I got- I did get the one upgrade. Hey, buddy. You're not- you're not really a big deal. Not really a big deal at all. Uh... Did we go down? I believe we started going up, but I don't know if we actually went down to see... 
what was over here. I think maybe we've been in there. Oh, okay. Well, we open this up. So we hadn't been in here. This is new. Shop. Your son? I uh, yeah. come here searching for rare items. Have you? Well, hands off. This collection is mine, and I won't be selling to grubby little wanderers. Still, I imagine you'd come across many interesting items in your travels. Maybe you'd care to part with some? I'll offer a fair trade for each. Velmi Arctrit. This guy. These journals give us an interesting glimpse into the mine. They're a common find, so I can't offer you too much for them. Uh, is there? Shh. Okay. Well, I know that he, this guy, will offer to buy some of my things, and I may be inclined to take that up. But I, I, I don't know. I'd like to, uh, I'd like to hold out and have some idea if those are used for anything else. Because if they are used for anything else, I want to be careful about how I use them. I don't know how many there are. How many I need. Okay, so we've got this. We've got an elevator that can go up more. The elevator... Oh. Got a couple things that were along the way there. So let's go down here and see if we can open that path that was blocked. We can. Alright, that was... That was not really a big deal. Ouch. I wasn't sure if hitting him would, uh, you know, make him explode or not. But it looks like it does. It looks like it might. We've already been in here, I believe, but we just never went up here to finish the job. Let's summon this elevator back up. Now! I'm gonna go this way. What is this? Anything? I hear the noises of a friend. Oops. Oops again. Hello, hello, annoying friend. So we already went through and opened those. That's probably what gave us the openings to be able to enjoy all of this, these goodies. Throw your lance. Oh, you're a sword friend. Why am I thinking you're a lance friend? Ouch. Okay. Alright, you guys. You're easy enough. Can you give me at least one point of health? So yeah, so my my thing with the the one guys, or the, the merchant, as it were, is it's a question of Ooh, there's a- okay, they're saying there's a bench up here. It's a question of, is that merchant used for anything else? Is this a seat? No. There's a grub- a grub friend! Ouch. Well, we've rescued you, so you go deal with your, uh, your buddies. Go up. Oh, we found the map. Or at least. Well, we haven't found it. We're near the map. We have to fight some dudes. With our upgrades, that was uh, not a big deal. Thankfully. 
I'd like to find this map friend. I hear him. A toll machine with symbol insert geo. How much for the map though? Make him know. And this change from those twisting natural caverns. The rain does cast something of a sadness upon it all, but the architecture is simply splendid. Charting such a different space is quite the challenge, though one I've eagerly undertaken. Perhaps you'd care to purchase a copy of my achievements so far. And I would. Yes! Okay, it's cheap, so I can get both of them. <laughs> what do you have to say, friend? We both come far to reach this grand place. While uh, I'm about these buildings, I must remember to collect a trinket or two for a Zelda. <laughs> oh! Do you add Chuckle more things to her uh, thing as we go along? I should double check what she has. We both come far to reach this place. Okay. Mm -hmm. yeah. So yeah, that means that maybe he uh, he gives some new things to our our, uh, our friendly merchant. What is this gonna give us? Mm -hmm. We had to pay for the bench. Okay. We've got some sort of uh, capitalist bench situation. Where is this gonna take us? This might- okay, let's actually let's consult the map since we have it. There's definitely a, a path that we had back there- oh! Hey, watch where you're going, you saggy- or soggy vagabond. I don't want you splashing me. I've had a terrible try time trying to keep dry. I am Zote the Mighty, a knight of great renown. Renown. If I decide that I'm going to stay dry, that's what I'm gonna- that's what's gonna happen. We're gonna do it. Curse this wretched city. Water and monsters constantly fall from above. It's no wonder this blasted kingdom fell to ruin. No, Have you seen job. them? The guards who still patrol the city even after dying? Oh, wait! No, me I talked to him elsewhere, that's why that line was familiar. I didn't talk to him in here, but I did- I did talk to him somewhere in this place. Like, he talked to me on a ledge, I think. Somewhere. Oh, we're going outside. Okay. Those spikes on that building are not to be landed upon. That appears to be obvious. Let's go in here. What is this? This looks like something of import, but I don't know what. For what reason? Where do I get a mining pick? I, I know that I could use one at some point, right? Because there were... Or something that knocks out the ground. Like in that, there was an area where some person was mining. I think that's actually near the city. And, uh, whoops. Let's see this guy. Some of his loot fell, but that's alright. see him. Get rid of this guy. We've got an item. Oh, a simple, a simple key. There was a a lock somewhere, but I don't remember where it was in particular, unfortunately. Let's see if I can jog my memory while wandering around. What's uh? Nope. <laughs> I don't know what I was thinking there. That was not the right choice of actions. Okay, we've dealt with our friend. So this part is safe. We need to go across here. I just wanted to see if there was anything on this ledge and that's what led to that little set of shenanigans. Some shenanigans. So above us, there's uh, where is this? What is this? So there's a rhino here. That's uh, that's useful. Can we get to it though? 
we have to go over this building that has spikes on top of it. I want to kill these guys and get some money because I'm assuming that the rhino is going to cost like at least 150. I don't remember how much they actually cost. 150 seems like I might have enough, but it might be a little more than that actually. Give me that and that. Okay, the rest is on the roof, which I can't get. We break this, makes our journey easier here. And this should be our rhino. Hopefully we can afford it. If not, I need to farm up a little money because I do need to have this access point. 200, okay. I think the last one was uh, like 150 or something that I purchased. So it's just stepping up in cost. Which is fine. Why did I- No! Okay. Thank you. Let's go kill these guys. Oh, there's an item there that I missed. In my haste to go check out the rhino friend, I missed this. A wanderer's journal. So I could sell one of those items, potentially before heading back into town, or, well, I can see what's in town and see what's worthwhile. So you have to go to the city, I guess, to sell those, which makes it, you know, a little more annoying. Unless that guy moves into town. I'm gonna guess that you just have to go to the city, though. What is this? Uh... <sighs> You have to pay for an elevator, or something. So I need... 200. And I need... Another... Uh, okay, let's go just hit the save point, or the bench, because I, I believe the bench resets the enemies. That's what it appeared to be, when I went out here. That one guy was back, so... Just a minute of farming this guy, maybe. Or these. Come here. Give me that loot. I need it. Oops. Why would I do such a thing? Oh, there's your other coin. So, I'll open the portal. I'll go look in town, maybe. And then maybe I'll go sell to that one guy. Or maybe I should sell first. Maybe I should just sell him and just hope that I uh, am good with that, you know? My worry is that they're like items that have a better use somewhere else and that selling them is a waste. So that's my concern. Not real sure what's gonna happen, but we can unlock our friend here. <laughs> Having a fast travel point back to the town is vital. The other thing is more for progression, but this is, uh, you know, obviously gonna be more important right now. Oh, it's our friend. I remember this station well. Common trip it was. Goods for all over the kingdom were transported here. Not a lot was sent back the other way, though. Yeah. Eager to travel the sideways? Just hop on the platform and give me a signal. We'll be on our way. So, let's go back to town. I want to go see if uh, Iselda has new items based on the conversation with... Oh, I can't remember his name. Also, I want to check with the town townskeeper to see if he has anything new to say based on me coming from the city. And I guess I should just check on everyone, pretty much. I could also go... Very well in your adventures below while well, I had an adventure of my own while you were gone. I don't usually visit the town's graveyard, but I thought I'd go and visit the grave of an old friend. As I was walking amongst the tombstones, I noticed a strange kind of chanting coming from somewhere nearby. Extremely sinister chanting. I looked around to find the source, and I saw two bright, horrible, huge eyes staring at me from the door of a dark cave. I pretended I hadn't heard the voice or seen the eyes and scurried back to town. My friend will have to wait a little longer for her visit. I hope you aren't too disappointed by our little town, Traveler, though it's a solemn place. Uh, once we were much more welcoming. 
Entry to the kingdom was forbidden long ago, supposedly after some great calamity. Many gates were closed, but our old well remains as a way to creep back in. Over the years, all kinds used the well to wriggle into rooms, wanderers, thieves, adventures. Funny how few ever come back up. Perhaps they find what they're looking for. Bah, I'm not so naive. No doubt they've all been gobbled up. There are countless dangers in those depths. So... Let's see if you have anything new. Mask, shroud, vessel, fragment. These all look like the same, but they, did they get stepped up in price? Are you charging more for things now? I can't even tell. Oh, uh, this is that. Let's go here. <sighs> Bapanada. You've cleaned us out of anything worth selling. Okay. So still nothing. Maybe it's maybe he in the near future will give us uh, new items. I don't think uh, I'm just doing a quick check in to see if you have anything interesting to say. Okay. So this person, I. Like I said, I assume that that person is about restoring your broken orb when you die. Not positive, but that that seems like the likely thing. I'm gonna go check out the grubs, because I've, I think, picked up a couple grubs since we've been there. Kill some easy guys for a little bit of money, since we are out, and I definitely need... Uh... I need 150? For the elevator, or whatever, the lift. Ooh You're gonna give me some though, right? Because uh, I rescued some of your friends. Yay! You give me 110? Anything else? Not bad. That was worth the trip. Is there anything around here that makes sense for me to go try to check out? I don't remember. I wonder if visiting the caster guy ever is worthwhile. Like if he gets uh, any new spells he can sell you or anything like that. That guy still too, took two hits. Even with my upgrades. Wait, ooh. Something's going on over here. Let's go check it out. There's like eye on the map, so I want to actually see. I did uh I did find like one of the masks on the statue, so I think it was the the four-eyed one. Let me see if there's any anything going on in here. I didn't do anything with it. So I guess not. Like, I didn't def defeat an enemy. I'm gonna guess that it's like Super Metroid and you have to defeat an enemy and whatnot. Okay, so let's go back to town. Then we're gonna take the portal over to where do we want to go we want to go back to the city we want to unlock the elevator give me a yeah come here that should be enough to unlock the elevator now I could have gotten it on the way but hey what's this Hello, Miss Seal. Because I decided to climb this instead of, uh, instead of using the... Uh, activatable thing. So I got a seal. Are those things worth keeping around for any reason? Or... 
Should I just be selling them to the one guy? That I don't know. It seems like a lot of money to get from that guy, which makes me kind of question whether it's something I should be doing. Although, I do kind of have to go out of the way in some cases to find these things, so it would be a kind of a nice reward just to get some money out of it. But I don't know why you wouldn't just give a person money or something for finding them if that was your intent. Like, oh, gotta have, have these things and then collect them. Got to time this uh, this part, so I don't even know how uh, how long I've been going. I'm gonna cut it right here just to see. It might end up being a short episode. It may be long. I don't even know. So, uh, see you guys in a bit, where we will go check out the elevator and whatnot. Uh, like the video if you haven't and you're enjoying it. Uh, subscribe to the channel if uh, if you haven't again, and I'll see you guys next time.